Welcome back to the Navy Sports Magazine. It's got him my right. Mike Heary and I have an awful lot of fun with he and his basketball teammates during the course of the season. It's Greg Summers. Big week for you guys. Shaking off last week. I mean, I can't imagine what Wednesday night against Bucknell, Saturday was like with six-week exams during the course of the week. Some guys are sleeping, you know, two and three hours during the course of the week. Just put into perspective what a week like last week was for a midshipman student athlete with all of the responsibilities that you guys had. Uh, yeah, the last week uh, with six weeks, it was pretty busy. So uh, we'd wake up, go to breakfast. Um, then we had to class, have a full day of class. Some some of us have six periods, so we get to practice late. Um, then we'd have like about an hour, 15 practice and possibly a lift right after. And then since it's six weeks, we got it. We have a bunch of exams coming up. So, you know, we're right, right back into the books. Got to, got to get right back. I was going to say a couple guys had, you know, two exams on game day and things right. of that nature. You know, that's almost where it might've been advantageous to be on the road last week. And you guys are at, at home for both right. games, but you know, is that part of, I guess, the growth of a student athlete here and obviously what the eventual mission is for you guys to to learn how to deal with events like last week definitely like as a student athlete like time management is key like you have to know when when you need to get right into the books and when you have time to relax and maybe get some sleep in so it's huge how how long is it taking you to understand time management here um it took me a while i i went to nap so at, at naps it took me a while to really understand it but once you get the hang of it it's pretty simple for you guys basketball wise to sweep Bucknell hadn't been done here since 2010. To, to get that sweep under your belts from a basketball perspective, what did that mean for you guys? It, it's huge. It's, it's another milestone and it, it's something that, that we can look at and say like, you know, it, we're, we've got something here. We have something special and we need to continue to build off of it. At the same time, it's a big week this week. You, you owe American one. You guys led late in the game here before they put together a game ending run. We know who's at the end of the week, but how do you focus on Wednesday night first to make sure you take care of the task there, and then worry about Saturday? Right. Uh, Wednesday we play American, so like uh, that's a game that we we should have won the first time we played them. And so going into this game on Wednesday, we know that we need to make a split, which is going to be huge for our rankings coming in on playoffs. And then um, obviously locking in right after that for uh, Army for the star game. So it, it, it's a big week, but we know what we have at, at hand and we know what we need to do to get done. It's a young team in terms of some freshmen, some sophomores playing, but some guys have some experience though. The fact that you've experienced a week like this, you've played on a Wednesday before going to Army. How much does that help now dealing with the pressures of this week? As we know, when you step on campus here, it's go Navy beat Army. Uh, honestly, it, it, it there's not much pressure we 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 know what we need to do it we we've we've gone through this the whole season and just get need to continue to push each other and hold each other accountable going forward so have you seen anything like i mean obviously this year every day it seems like the standings flip right you know uh so d does it i don't want to say i don't know if pressure is the right word but does it put uh you know a, an impetus for you guys to play with some urgency knowing that each result could be the difference between maybe being third or potentially sixth or seventh uh, in the standings from uh, night to night. Right. It, like anybody's beatable on any given night. So we, we know we need to be ready and locked in uh, going into the game. And it's huge for us these last final four games of the season um, for ranking. So we'll we'll definitely be ready. We're locked in and then uh, we know we need to get it done. Obviously, too, you're, you know, putting last week behind you. Do you guys feel a I mean, nobody's ever 100% at this time of the year, but do you feel a sense of refreshment here a little bit in terms of physically? Because, I mean, physically and mentally, both last week had to be as draining as heck. Uh, yeah, definitely. Like the week after six weeks is definitely a lot more refreshing. But, um, yeah, like body-wise, uh, we're always in the training room. We're, we're trying to get our body healthy for the, the following game because we have like two two days in between uh, to get ready for our next game on the Wednesday or Saturday. So, yeah. Um, uh, body body wise and mentally wise like we we're always trying to make sure we're we're ready going forward to see guys like Richard and Joku and Tyler Nelson, Jalen Walker, Daniel Deaver, Patrick Dorsey's even gotten some minutes here of late to see those guys coming in and and being more reliable for you all, you know, a guy like Cam may not necessarily have to play 36 minutes now because a Sean Yoder can give him, you know, some minutes at the one 
you know, obviously you're able to handle the ball. You'll, you'll get a rebound and, and take the ball up the floor yourself. Seeing the development of those guys being to uh, contribute a little bit more, does that give you all a little more oomph at this time of the year Definitely. now that you guys are a deeper club? Any any great team, like we we know like the, the bench is key for any great team. And having those guys come off the bench and contribute in, in uh, really positive ways like uh, Richard did like this past game, like that's huge for us. We need we need more of that and especially with Tyler and Sean and um, even Pat coming in and, and Jalen Walker. So like that's huge for, for us going forward. And uh, we, we definitely need more of that from them. Obviously the Patriot League tournament will determine uh, the, the fate of everybody's season. But in terms of the regular season, is there anything you played in it last year? Is there anything like playing in a star game when, when Army and Navy get together? The atmosphere is great. And I, I love playing in it. Like big crowd, like uh, both teams know the – the gravity of the of the game, so uh, we're, we'll we'll be ready. I I really enjoy the star game. So. All right, big fella, appreciate the time. Best of luck this week against American and Army. Yep, thank you. You got a great summer's joining us here on the Navy Sports Magazine.